the world and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you can see in the title today is a travel day. I tried to say that as enthusiastically as I could but it is so early right now. It's literally 7.02 a.m. and I'm a girl who sleeps in until noon. So I am flying from Calgary to my hometown province in Manitoba and the reason being is because I just graduated last week and I thought what better way to close this chapter than by getting some closure of going back home, seeing my hometown friends, I guess I don't really have many, but seeing my hometown friends, seeing my family and just kind of getting the closure and accepting that I'm an adult. It's kind of bizarre saying that out loud because although like I'm 19 and I've almost 20 and I've been an adult for like two years, now that I'm not a student, it's like becoming real. But anyways, we quickly whipped together a bag last night. We packed it. I only get a backpack. I don't get a carry on at all. So I had to shove everything in there, but I'm just going to finish grabbing like the smaller things that I missed out, like my toothbrush, my hairbrush and all of that and shove it in my bag. And then I will take you guys along the travel day. electronic kit filled right here so um, I'll have all my cords and then I will also have my camera and tripod when I'm not using it and also the attachments to my MacBook so I can edit while I'm home and then I also have this backpack here and it is full to actually it's not even full to the brim it's got plenty of space but I'm just gonna kind of show you what's on top to keep me entertained and what I plan to do on the plane. I actually don't do much on the planes other than watch shows and like maybe sometimes read. So I have um, my book just on top. This is the one I'm gonna start. It is The Suspect. And I'm actually super excited to read this because anything with like this kind of, okay, don't use my face, please. This kind of texture on a book it's always killer. Okay, killer. So I'm gonna start this book, I think. And then I also downloaded a pile of shows on my phone. So I downloaded Animal Kingdom and Pretty Little Liars because those are the two that I'm binging right now. Okay, I think I got everything packed, hopefully. Got my ID, I got my keys, I got my AirPods, I got clothes, books journals i think i have everything so now i'm gonna go wake up brayden so he can drive me to the airport here oh, holy fuck you're not forgetting me oh, you scared me good morning queen good morning Calgary Airport. I've only been to Edmonton's airport. So I left myself enough time to navigate Edmonton's small airport where I know everywhere and I'm kind of nervous to step into this one because it's a big bad world and I don't exactly know where I'm going and I don't have, I hope so, but I don't really have 
Actually, it's 7.45. I think I have time. We left early for this reason. You left early for this reason. I, I did leave early for I, you for this reason. I did not think this through. Yeah, I know. I did. I got you. Appreciate it. Shut it. This is all my shit. Oh, flare it down there. No, that's like... The love of my life. I am in the airport and I am honestly feeling very lost. Like I walked into where it said Flair and then Flair wasn't there. So I'm just wandering, I guess, trying to find where I'm supposed to be. I might ask somebody though. through security pretty okay but I went to go find my gate on my boarding pass and it doesn't actually say a gate number so I'm gonna call my mom hi um, so I put my flare like thing into my wallet but it doesn't have a gate number beyond confused right now I literally followed the gate that's like ABC and then I like went into a dead end and I don't understand okay this thing is causing me problems but I think I'm finally going into the right direction um, I don't know if I'm gonna have time to get a coffee or not but I'm hoping that I do Winnipeg. Now I have to uh, find my grandma because she's taking me up from the airport and we are going to drive two and a half hours to Minidosa. Mm -hmm. 